that keeps playing till Alice comes out. Make things a whole lot 
It would make things a whole lot easier on everybody. Don't you think it really would? Probably. Good. Suit yourself. How's my hair? Fine. Not pooching out in the back, is it? No. All right, now. I've got to go. I've got to head on back home and check on P.K. and Buck Jr. I've left them with any man. Honestly, I don't like to leave them with her for long periods of time. Her mind is as loose as a sieve. Honestly, it is. Oh, 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 oh. I almost forgot. Happy birthday to Lenny from the Buck Boy.
down and said, Mr. Sumo, I'm dead with food. Oh, look, Lenny, you brought my suitcase from home and my saxophone. Now well, that's thank you. Longer. It's going to be over here this afternoon. Man, come up here and look at my saxophone. He dances. That about what he used to do. Jackson? So here, hold it. The old is not. Isn't that what they'll do? They'll throw away the key. Well, honestly, I don't know about that. Well, they will. And they will leave you there to rot. So, Rebecca, what are you going to tell Mr. Lloyd about shooting Zachary when he gets here this afternoon? What are your reasons going to be? That I didn't like his looks. That I didn't like his stinking looks. And I don't like yours much either, chick the stink. So, you just leave me alone. You hear me? Just leave me alone. Well, I was only trying to warn her that she is going to have to help herself. But she does not seem to understand the seriousness of the situation, does she? It's like she doesn't have the baby to make it does she now? It's true. She does, she does seem a little confused. And that is putting it mildly, Lenny, honey. That is putting it mighty mild. So, Mark. How's your singing career going? <laughs> we keep looking for your picture in the movie magazines. <laughs> you know you shouldn't smoke. They say it causes cancer. Cancer of the lungs. They say each cigarette is just a little stick of cancer. A little dead stick. That's what I like about it, chick. It's like taking a drag off of death. Gives me a sense of controlling my own destiny. What power. What exhilaration. You want to drag? <gasps> hey, so, um, Zachary's liver's been saved? Is that good news? My sister called and said his liver's been saved. That's fine news. I hear the liver is a very important bodily organ that, uh, that gets rid of all the excess bile. Yeah. Well, it's been saved. <laughs> <coughs> so, did you, did you hear all that good news about the liver, little chicken? I heard it. And I told you not to call me chicken. If I had told you a hundred uh, times, I had uh, told you uh, once uh, that you uh, would not uh, call me chicken. Uh, oh, no. Oh, my goodness. Oh, no. Okay, we'll be right over. Oh, that was Andy May, P.K. Buck Jr. eating paints. Oh, well, then I was sick, all then I was sick. I don't know. I don't know. Come on, we need to run next door. Oh, God! Oh, please don't let him die! Please don't let him die! Has she gone? She's gone. P.K. and Buck Jr. just ate their paint. What idiots. Yeah. You know, Chick's hated us ever since we moved here from Vicksburg to live with our grandma and our granddaddy. She's an idiot. Yeah. What do you know what she told me this morning? <coughs> When I was still behind bars and couldn't get away. What? She told me how embarrassing it was for her. Well, all those years ago. You know when Mama? Yeah, down in the cellar. But she said our Mama had shamed our entire family. And then we were known notoriously over at Hazelhurst. And then now, I was going to be getting just as much bad publicity and humiliation. 